yeah. and I know that that system is what's being a rainmaker up here right now. N not nearly as dangerous as what we've seen down there, Star. That's true, Kirsten. We are on the northern uh, end of that storm system. So just as you said, not as devastating uh, in any bit. We do uh, start off, however, with some of that rain uh, because of the storm system moving through. It's going to continue through a large portion of today. And the system also bringing some of that uh, snow and sleet for areas in the Hudson Valley. Now, temperature wise, we'll be slightly below where we should be a good five degrees or so. So not too bad. And again, those highs that we're expecting to see today don't come until this evening. We get to the ending of our weekend and things will dry back out. We're talking sunshine for tomorrow and temperatures rebounding back into the 60s, but we are in store for another rainmaker as we move into uh, the first part of next week. So again, tracking this storm system moving across our satellite and radar, uh, just mostly uh, bringing rain across the boroughs. We do again continue to track some of those flurries and again some of that uh, wintry mix moving across not just uh, Sussex County, but portions of the Hudson Valley as well. Taking a wider look out shows that the leading edge of uh, this next part of the storm is due to approach us, which is going to bring us some on and off again rain throughout portions of the day. So in our eight o'clock hour right now, we do show uh, that's rain moving across the area. Moving into this afternoon, we're expecting things to become a little bit more widespread. As we make our way into our evening hours, I'm talking eight o'clock or so, we do start to see a warm front lifting into the area and this has the possibility of bringing some of those heavier downpours but also wouldn't be surprised if we hear some of that thunder uh, roaring through the area expected to dry back out moving into the later parts of our evening as we uh, get through today our accumulation for rain totals anywhere from about a half an inch to uh, three quarters of an inch the further inland you go and again depending on how slow this storm system moves and how severe it does become moving through portions of a Jersey there. Not only are we dealing with rain today, we're also dealing with some pretty windy conditions. Now our sustained winds still pushing from the east. We're talking a good 10 to 20 miles per hour, but our gusts are going to be moving pretty heavy as well. We're talking a good 25 to 35 miles per hour across the area. Temperature wise, we're not expecting to hit our, uh, our highs until the second half of our day. Again, again, still coming in the upper 40s across the city. Most of our boroughs in the low to mid 40s. By the time we get to tomorrow, things will be a lot nicer, not just just temperature wise hopping into the 60s, but also we do get some more bright conditions. But by the start of next week, we do have another rain maker moving in. It's expected to carry on through Tuesday, but temperature wise through most of next week, we're expected to be pretty seasonable and then we're getting a little bit more sunshine by the time we move to the middle of next week.